I'm Tyler Butler, and today we're here getting to know Peter Norman, the writer in residence at McCune University. Peter, what's your favorite book? Probably The Trial by Kafka. And what's the last movie you watched? A Most Violent Year. And your favorite way to de-stress? Open a beer, turn on the hockey game. What's your favorite hockey team? With apologies, I was born and raised there. It's the Vancouver Canucks. Cats or dogs? Uh, traditionally dogs, but the great love of my life, as far as pets are concerned, was a cat. And what's the first job you ever had? Busboy. What's the worst job you've ever had? Door-to-door -door salesman. Is there a song that you can't get out of your head? Can't get you out of my head. What's the best meal you've ever had? I'm going to go with uh, this year's Thanksgiving dinner. Do you have a favorite holiday? Christmas. Is there a teacher who inspired you? Uh, there was a teacher I had in high school named Robin Baker, who was uh, English and history and was awesome. What's your favorite place to write? As long as I can plug in my laptop, anywhere is good. How many siblings do you have? I've got two. And what is your least favorite word? YOLO. If you could have any superpower, what would it be? Uh, the ability to choose any superpower at any time for any purpose. What is your favorite trick to overcome writer's block? Uh, just put my hands on the keyboard and start to move them around. Pen or pencil? Pen. And can you tell me how many books you own? I cannot tell you that. It's a large number. What's the best idea you've ever had? Um, when I was a kid, I thought I might try to become a lawyer, is which there, I did not. Is there anything that makes your skin crawl? Maggots. And what about your biggest fear? Uh, moral failure, I would say. Uh, coffee or tea? Coffee. And last question, is there an author who you most admire? Um, the guy in the movie The Diving Bell and the Butterfly, uh, I think his name was Jean-Dominique Bobby, and he uh, was paralyzed except for his left eyelid, and yet he wrote a book under those circumstances. Thank you, Peter. You can find out more about the writer-in-residence at mcewen.ca slash wir.